previously on General Hospital. Want to go to the deception launch party? If Xander's not going to be there, I don't want to be there either. I don't think you should be fighting Gia's battles for her. Someone has to stand by her so she doesn't do something stupid. You're going to be the face of deception. The announcement is going to go ahead as planned. You got to help me keep Laura from making that announcement tomorrow. These look good, yes. so one on each table. Eight o'clock at the deception offices. Well, we look forward to seeing you. Well, that was Miles Schaefer's office. Mr. Schaefer will be covering the face of deception launch party tonight. No. Yes. Oh, my goodness, you're a miracle worker. How did you do that? Oh, incessant pestering. Uh, incessant pestering would not sway poor Charles' top feature photographer. Truthfully, my press contacts are better than ever, and nobody could be more thrilled than I. Do you realize that virtually every reporter and photographer I contacted accepted our invitation? Elton, I have so much to thank you for. Oh, pish. My thanks will be a gala of pure magic. But listen, uh, wow, if we're going to have such high-profile coverage, we have got to pull off a successful launch. Have no fear. I shall do everything within my power to ensure a perfect evening. Okay, let's just go over the list one more time, though, all right? Uh, perhaps we should contact Mrs. Corinthos. She may have some last-minute input. Why? You're asking for trouble. I mean, come on, everything's been ordered and all the details have been decided on. And we're going to go ahead with this launch as we planned it. Okay, let's see. Modeling, it just, it leaves you so exposed to the rest of the world. You're always on display. You're the object of desire for thousands of men when some mornings you just want to pull the sheets over your head and disappear. Lucky the door's open. But I'm not ready, and at this rate I never will be. Need some help? Oh, desperately. Oh. Okay, what is it? <clears throat> the clothing, the makeup... Stage fright? Um, everything. You can start with my clown lips. Here. They're not bad. You just need to blot them a little bit. Right? You know, Laura was nice enough to send over a stylist, mm -hmm. but I think you went a little overboard. Or maybe I'm not just used to this whole glamour look. And I tried to fix it, but I, I think I made it worse. How's that look? Oh. Yeah, that's better. So does this mean you're not angry with me anymore? No, of course not. Mm -hmm. I want you to have a good time tonight. So does that mean you're gonna be there? Actually, no, I haven't changed my mind about that. If Xander's not welcome, I, I don't really want to be there. I'm, really, I'm really sorry, Elizabeth, don't but... worry about me, okay? You're gonna have a fabulous time. I'm gonna tone down those cheeks just a little bit. I mean, these stripes on my face. You know, it's not just the makeup thing that's making me uncomfortable. It's, I can't help but thinking what's gonna happen when the ad campaign comes out. You know, all the press, the publicity, my face being plastered everywhere. I'm just not sure that I'm, I'm ready for this. Or... Your personal photographer at your service. Hmm. You ready for stardom? I can hardly wait. Are you ready yet? Be patient. This happens to be very hard work. Well, I mean, if, if you know, if... If you don't want to go, we can always just go have dinner at the, uh, the Port Charles Grill. I mean, it could be my, uh, tr treat. What do you think? Yeah. Just, uh, give me a minute for my, my brain to work. Then I've achieved the desired effect. Yeah, if your effect is to have men fall at your feet, you have... Not just men. The whole room. Including your mother and all her advertising cronies. Well, when you walk into that party, I guarantee you, all eyes will be on you. 
Good, because I want everyone to eat their hearts out when they see the runner-up. This doesn't uh, have anything to do with Carly, does it? That's just, uh, that's just stupid. It's a good thing that I checked that menu. It's a disaster. Well, Mrs. Spencer was quite specific. Okay, listen, nobody eats crudite anymore. You need to call the caterer ASAP and tell them to dump the raw vegetables, and we need something like little mini crab cakes, some um, sirloin with skewers through them, maybe some, oh, I don't know, you know, puffs with those little, little, um, you know, green pea things on them. Uh, capers? Capers, yeah, 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 that. And if Laura so much as says boo, I assure you, Miss Spencer is just as invested in the success of this evening as you are. Yeah, but unfortunately we can't agree on so much as a celery stick. Well, I'm sure there's got to be a middle ground somewhere, and I consider it my job to find it so that you shall both be happy. Okay, listen. She does not announce the phase until I get there, okay? Promise me. Excuse this... me. We'll be there shortly, Elton. Honey, that was a business call. Yeah, well, I'm just looking out for my gorgeous wife. It's your big night. We're gonna have a little champagne, relax. By the time you get to the party... I'll be drunk. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be ready to enjoy the evening. You could teach Laura some negotiating. I wouldn't want to. It's your company, not mine. And, uh... You're doing a great job. Thank you. Not everybody thinks so, but... Give them time. Tonight is the night. Ah, uh, well, I'm gonna show people what I can do tonight. You just wait and see. General Hospital on ABC, brought to you by Zocor. Talk to your doctor about Zocor today. We rescued this old boat years ago. It's how we planned to spend our retirement. Then I had a heart attack. I worried we'd never set sail. Turns out my cholesterol was high. How will you take care of your high cholesterol and heart disease? I began exercising and eating better, but it was still too high. So I asked my doctor about adding Zocor. He told me Zocor, along with diet, can really get your cholesterol down. And Zocor has proven to reduce the risk of a heart attack among people with high cholesterol and heart disease. Now my cholesterol is right where it should be. Zocor is a prescription medication and is not for everyone, including women who are nursing, pregnant, or may become pregnant, or people with liver problems. Your doctor may do blood tests to check for liver problems. Because serious side effects can result, tell your doctor about any muscle pain or weakness you experience and about any medicines you are taking. For more information about Zocor, talk to your doctor. Do it for yourself. It's your future. Be there. Air. It's in the air. Carefree, breathable panty liners keep you fresh and dry. They're the only ones with air spun, a unique layer that lets air through. Every day, be fresh. Be carefree. Now there's a new way to resist temptation. Thick, nutritious, delicious Metabolife ready-to-drink shakes are a more satisfying way to reduce calories and fat in your diet. It's the special ingredients that make the difference, and you're going to love the results. Metabolife meal replacement shakes really help keep you going. So don't just replace a meal. Enjoy the delicious shake that has earned the Metabolife name. Look for Metabolife shakes at fine stores everywhere. From the makers of Metabolife 356. Mommy's mimicking me! Mommy's mimicking me! They're two ordinary kids, except for one thing. Your parents are international spies. Something's gone wrong. My parents can't be spies. They're not cool enough. That's cool. Now, they're on a mission to rescue their parents and stop an evil genius. Oh. Spy Kids, rated PG, in theaters Friday, March 30th. Would you believe Jennifer and Billy have bonded? Listen. Wow. What a sensation. Incredible. New Arm & Hammer Sensation Toothpaste. Cool, high energy for a sensational clean that lasts. My dentist will love it. Dentist. dentist. New sensation. Tonight, there is no fire hot enough to kill it. Mad cow disease. There's no treatment. There's no vaccine. There's nothing you can do. Could it come to America? 
are we doing everything we could to protect our beef? They didn't take action until it was too late. 2020, with an important report for your whole family tonight. Yes, I know, I know it's terribly last minute, but if you think we're asking the impossible, we'll understand. Uh, oh, you can. Well, that'd be wonderful. Thank you. We'll see you very soon. Uh, Mrs. Corinthos called in with a few last-minute additions to our menu. So I gathered. Well, I scanned her suggestions and added only the ones I thought most appropriate to the tone which you've set for this evening. It seems the least we can do. And don't worry about the cost. It's all covered in the budget. Elton, you missed your calling. You should have been a diplomat. Well, I do the best I can. I know. And please continue to tonight. Relax. This evening will be pure perfection. I promise. Hmm. I hope so. Laura? Hi. Uh, Kai. Oh, you look nice. Wow. Look at you. Oh. Dressed for success. You like it? You're not too austere, too sensible? I don't know. Classic. Just the right image. <laughs> for a CEO of a successful cosmetics company. Oh, thanks. That's what I thought, too. But, then, you know, then when I was getting dressed, I started to feel like a little girl trying on dress-up clothes. I don't know. Ooh. I just hope I can fool everybody tonight. That's a good sign. Really? Yeah, it means you're forging new ground. You're taking chances, ready to sort of new heights. Wow. Remind me to invite you over more often. <laughs> well, I accept all future invitations. <laughs> Here you go. Open your present. Oh my gosh, that's, oh, it's heavy. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty heavy. Well, Georgie says, the heavier the better. Oh, wow. How sweet of you. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> to help you on the road to success. That's so sweet of you. Thank you very much. So, uh, well, what if I break down tonight? Will it, will it work on me, too? See, look. <laughs> just patch a tire, turn on your high beams, and you're ready to roll. Okay. Thank you. Really nice. Hello, Mac. Hi. Hiya, Laura. Sam Hill is that for? Uh, uh, unruly reporters. That's right. Just don't forget your flares. Oh, okay. I'll save that for really big emergencies like uh, running out of cocktail napkins. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. You look fantastic. Oh, well, thanks to Emily. Hey, all I did was blot and blend. Oh, you did a lot more than that. Oh, come on. Give yourself some more credit. You could walk into that party with no makeup on and still turn every head. Hey. I want you to keep your head high tonight. And be real happy, okay? That's good advice. You guys, I'll be fine. You want to come with us? We'll wait while you change. Actually, I'm, uh, I'm uh, spending the night with Xander, so thank you. Emily, thank you so much for everything. Good luck, Kay. I'll call you later. Hi, sweetie. Hi. So, you ready? Not yet. You're not fooling anyone. I know you're scared to death. <sighs> it's a little overwhelming. <laughs> it would be for anybody. I mean, this whole thing has happened so fast. A few meetings, photo shoots. And here we are, your debut night. Yeah, it hasn't quite registered. Well, just know that I'm going to be by your side all night. And you're going to be relaxed in no time. I think so. Just stay focused on what a great opportunity this is for both of us. I mean, you're going to be able to support yourself as an artist. I'm going to be a photographer with a future instead of a handyman with dreams of playing the guitar. <laughs> you changed my whole life, Elizabeth. I can't thank you enough. You did it yourself. No, we both did it together. The two of us on top of the world after everything that we've been through. On top of the world? Sounds kind of precarious. Well, we'll keep each other balanced. I'm counting on it. So this is your last anonymous night. From now on, people will recognize you and love you wherever you go. To my brilliant wife. I'll drink to that. Who has absolutely nothing to prove to me or to anyone. Where did that come from? Well, I, I'm guessing you have a, 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 a scheme. Here. Mr. Suspicious. No more secret plans, you promise. I promise you that I have no secret plans as far as our 
marriage is concerned. Oh, so you admit it. I admit what? That you're, you're, you're going to pull something at deception. I cannot believe this. You don't even trust me. Did I say that? <sighs> Look, I don't <laughs> interfere in your business strategies, do I? Well, at least not anymore. <laughs> well, not lately. And I'm sure that there are some pretty, you know, complicated decisions that you have to make. Right. But I have faith in you. Completely. And it should go both ways. You're right. Ooh, yeah. okay. <laughs> Thank you, sweetie. I love you so much. And you are so good to me to give me so many wonderful things like this company. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make you proud. What are you accusing me of now? I haven't heard from Carly since yesterday. Well, Carly said you should have been the face of deception. I could uh, practically hear the wheels spinning. Well, Carly can think what she wants. Yeah, well, as long as she doesn't drag you into one of her crash and burn schemes, yes. I'm not going to let myself be manipulated if that's what you mean. Look, I know Carly wants you as the face of deception. Okay, and I also know that well, how determined my mother gets when she makes up her mind. Now, you, you get in the middle of this, you, this whole thing can blow up in your face. I doubt anything that drastic will happen. <laughs> Gia, listen, if you are planning to go to this party tonight in the hopes of emerging as the face of deception, I'm just... I'm afraid that you're going to be in for a major letdown. For your information, I've made peace with Elizabeth's unearned victory. Unearned? What, I can't be honest? But you are ready to warmly congratulate her, right? I've put this behind me. There are, the face of deception is not the only modeling job out there. And the truth is, Laura has done me a favor. I mean, I've had some experience as a model, and I realize it's what I want to do. And this party is a great opportunity for me. I mean, I'll be able to meet photographers and fashion writers, modeling reps, and um, designers even hang out with Chloe Morgan. And I am sure that she will get some... <laughs> Some inspiration from that dress of yours, that's for sure. Well, she already has. It's a Chloe Morgan original. And if you think for one second that I'm going to skip going to the party after all the trouble I went through to buy this, think again, because I can just call a car service or call Carly, have her pick me up in her limo. Hey, hey. You are one of the strongest, bravest people I've ever known. Okay, and I'm very, very proud of you for going tonight. You are showing them that you are a real winner, even though you did not get the job, and you're right. There will be a lot of other opportunities. I know. I do have one question, though. What? Well, how did you manage to pay for a Chloe Morgan original? I'm glad you like it, because you're looking at five months' rent in a size six. This dress is an investment in my future, and my future is beginning tonight. Hey, what are you doing? The week before my periods, like? I get super moody. I'd cry over anything and couldn't be around anyone. That time of the month, nothing ever fit. Think it's PMS? Think again. If you suffer from many of these symptoms month after month and they clearly interfere with your daily activities and relationships, you could have PMDD, premenstrual dysphoric disorder, a distinct medical condition. It causes intense mood and physical symptoms right before your period. Doctors can now treat PMDD with Seraphim, the first and only prescription medication for PMDD. Seraphim is not for everyone. If you develop a rash or hives while taking Seraphim, call your doctor right away because this can be a sign of a serious medical condition. People treated with MAOIs or thyroidazine should not take Seraphim. Tell your doctor about any medications you're taking or if you're pregnant, nursing, or plan to become pregnant. Side effects may include tiredness, upset stomach, nervousness, dizziness, and difficulty concentrating. Talk to your doctor about Seraphim today. 
Now there's a new, even colder dead teen ice gum. Arctic chill, cool breath, fresh breath like never before. Arctic chill, new from Dentine Ice, ice at its coldest. It's here, McDonald's next big thing, the new Big and Tasty. Now just 99 cents to celebrate the opening of Disney's California Adventure, Disney's newest theme park, right next door to Disneyland in California. So, how does a 99 cent Big and Tasty sound? Freezing chicken. Only Ziploc Double Guard freezer bags have an inner layer that clings to seal out air that causes freezer burn. Regular freezer bags don't. Put an end to freezer burn with a Ziploc Double Guard freezer bag. Freezing steak. Only Ziploc Double Guard freezer bags have an inner layer that clings to seal out air that causes freezer burn. Regular freezer bags don't. Put an end to freezer burn with a Ziploc Double Guard freezer bag. This little piggy went to market. These piggies this have piggy. power with the Kickstart Gym from Play School. One kick starts music and silly fun, and that's a pretty big step for little piggies. The Kickstart Gym from Play School. Two ways to treat your skin to a facial. $65, please. Olay Daily Facials. Without making an appointment or having to wait, you can cleanse, exfoliate, clarify, and hydrate your skin at home. Use it every day for a month, and it's just like your skin had a facial. Olay Daily Facials. Proven to cleanse and exfoliate like a facial. A mother's biggest fear is that her daughter will make the same mistake she's made. You do not know what the world is like. You don't know what the world is like! Amy and Isabel strikes at the heart of that fear. If people knew we were kissing each other, they really wouldn't understand. Have you any idea how you've injured my child? Oprah Winfrey presents Amy and Isabel, Sunday night, 8 central on ABC. Mm -hmm. oh, you're smearing. Control yourself. Okay, too late. <laughs> you're not trying to make us a party, are you? Why would I do that? If you don't want to go, just say so. Well, what if I didn't want to go? Well, then I'd probably make you go anyway, and I'd be grumpy all night, so I wouldn't chance it if I were you. Okay, well, this is your big event. I, I want to see my wife shine. Good answer. Let's go. Uh, we, we, gotta, we gotta wait for Alexis. Who invited Alexis? I did. Why? Well, because I, I need somebody to, to talk to. Well, what am I? Chop liver? You're gonna be cruising the room, you're gonna be charming the contacts, you know? You won't have time for me. I always have time for my husband. And, sweetie, if you get really bored, Elton would love to entertain you, I'm sure. <laughs> Elton, yeah. great. You could give him some, you know, cooking tips. Yeah, or I can, I can be across the room with Alexis. She's gonna stand out like a sore thumb. And this is a party for the fashion world. She'll show up in her no-nonsense, you know, gray power suit and, and sensible shoes. Miss Davis. Oh. I heard that. On a list of 500 things that I would rather not do, this being 499, I believe that's just above the walking tour of the Siberian tundra. Oh, well, this is very thank big you for, of you. Thank you, for, thank you for coming. Okay. How's Xander? Uh, following the rules? To the letter. Uh, coming in by curfew, notify my drivers if, uh, you know, he wants to go anywhere. Look at me. I'm a babysitter. You know, looking out for Xander is one thing, but being summoned to go to this stultifyingly boring corporate party is another. Alexis, I owe you. Yes, you do. You know what? I have what? a great idea. Hmm. Why don't you just stay home? Hello. Wow. Don't you look... Gorgeous. Thank you, and thank you so much for going with me. I wasn't up for going to this thing on my own. Still miss Jax? Yeah, partly. Partly, I just feel so out of the loop, you know? I have all that time on the island. I just need to go renew my contacts, show my face. You ready to go? Mm-hmm. After we cover one small detail, this isn't another Ned Alexis setup, is it? No. 
Absolutely not. I have done everything I can for you two. You're on your own. Good. Mm-hmm. Will Alexis be there? I don't know. I don't think so. I mean, I don't think she would be interested in a cosmetics party. It wouldn't be her idea of a fascinating evening. Good point. But, Ned, if she is there, you don't have to speak to her. What are you suggesting? That I duck and hide at the sight of Alexis? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wow. Oh, dear, maybe I should start circulating, huh? Hey, can I follow you? Maybe I can get a lead on a job opportunity. <laughs> uh, you in the fashion and beauty industry? I, I don't know. I can't quite see that. What are you talking about? Isn't my style cutting edge? Look at this. Oh, no, you look fabulous. That's not what I meant. Well, thank you. You guys are sharing a lot of jokes here. I don't know. I'm not sure what's going on. I resigned as police commissioner. Kidding. No, oh, I couldn't be more serious. Well, I know there's a lot of pressures to that job, but uh, just to quit like that, huh, Mac? I didn't think about it. I just quit. Well, act first, think later. I like that about you. I mean, that's pretty much what I did here. I, I quit my job and I jumped into the business world without any planning, any experience, any anything, and I think it's one of the best things I've ever done. What about that nutty partner of yours? Well, I was just talking about the business part of it. Oh, yeah. Look who I bumped into. Hi. Hey. Oh, Amy, you look radiant Hello. as always. You too. And Elizabeth, you look absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Hi, Lucky. Hello. Oh, does everyone know that Lucky is going to be Deception's new photographer? Wow, congratulations there, Lucky. Lucky, that's great. I didn't know that you were interested in photography. He is a wonderful photographer. He has a real knack for bringing out the inner quality of his subjects. And his photographs have a lot of um, spontaneity, and they're very natural. Of course, my mother isn't the least bit prejudiced. <laughs> and every word of it is true. Well, I had a great subject. Scotty, can I talk to you for a second? Oh, Amy, Amy, what? Brian Carver, WDFS. Would that subject be the new face of deception? Uh, we'll be making our announcement a little bit later in the evening. Uh, how about a hint? I'm sorry, you're gonna have to wait. What's, uh, what's the big deal about Mac being here? You're the one that should be upset about Mac being here. Well, I didn't make the guest list. Scotty, can you just open up your eyes, take off your blinders, realize that Max is moving in on Laura? Ah! Yeah! Elizabeth, how are you feeling? I'm okay. Oh, okay. Um, listen, I will I will signal you before I make the big announcement. And when I'm done, I want you to come up and just say a few words. Laura, I didn't know I was expected to say anything. No, no, just a few off-the-cuff remarks, that's all. Well, like, what? I don't have a speech prepared. No, 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 no just no like, um, just hello. And I'm so pleased to meet you all. I'm very happy to be the new face of deception. And that's it. That's all, okay? Really, that's it. I, I just want them to have the opportunity to photograph you. I didn't know I'd be posing tonight either. <sighs> Excuse it's not posing. It's being yourself. All right. Uh, okay. You look wonderful. I agree. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about the cameras. I'm going to be right here beside you. And so will I. So if you feel nervous, just look at us. And remember something, all right? Tonight is your big night, Elizabeth. Don't let anything ruin it for you. Good evening. Wow. Yeah. Congratulations on winning the job, Elizabeth. essential scented body wash juicy from head to toe this saturday march 3rd one day one store one sale so astounding you have to see it to believe it sears super saturday sale starts friday 5 p.m to me a headache is like this little thief trying to rob me of time i need to get things done so I take Excedrin. It has two pain relievers, plus this enhancing ingredient, so it kind of gangs up on my headache. No wonder it works better than Tylenol. Excedrin takes care of the little thief, and I take care of everything else. Excedrin, the headache medicine. Disney's Lady and the Tramp 2 is now on video. 
It's a tale of a headstrong pup. I want to run wild and free. And the caring father who loves him. I was just like you when I was your age. How would you know? You were never like me. Now his son must learn. You have a family that loves you. That the best things in life. I'd give anything to have what you have. Are right in your own backyard. Let's go home, Pop. Lady and the Tramp 2. Own it today on video and Disney DVD. When you bite into a York peppermint patty, you might get the sensation that you're competing in the two-man bobsled whizzing down an icy track in the chilling mountain air. York peppermint patty, get the sensation. An ocean breeze, what could feel cleaner? Maybe yours truly. I'm Cottonelle Toilet Paper, and my cushy ripples are designed to leave you feeling fresh, dry, and confidently clean. Cottonelle, when you think of clean, think of me. General Hospital will continue in a moment, here on ABC. Throughout history, the women America admired most have all been known for their deep compassion until now. Don't give me a lot of baloney. I know everything. Stop. Lie to me. Am I right? They know. I say yes. I win. I'm the judge. Judge Judy, weeknights at 7 on San Diego's Tear. We need them as teachers, so why aren't there more African-American men in the classroom? We find important answers tonight on 10 News Live at 5. This weekend, San Diego Convention Center. Pentium Computers, $299. Pentium 2 Computers, $399. Camcorders, $199. Digital Camcorders, $399. VCRs, $39. PlayStation Games, $10. N64 and Dreamcast, $15. PlayStation 2 Games, $29. DVD Players, $89. DVDs, $10. Satellite Systems, $29. Calvin Klein, Hilfiger, Gas, Fubu, Polo, Lodge. Nine West, Devon Picot, Nike, Fila, Reebok. More shoes and clothing from $10. San Diego Convention Center. Friday noon to 10. Saturday 10 to 9. Sunday 11 to 6. Attention shoppers, the Fiesta is now in progress in aisle 7. Ortega is bringing a Fiesta of flavor to the freezer aisle, like our new skillet fajitas. We take marinated strips of steak or chicken, toss them with garden vegetables and Ortega's authentic seasonings. Oh, yeah! For a sizzling family favorite in minutes. Viva Ortega! New Ortega skillet fajitas, part of the Fiesta of flavor in your freezer. Look to the local news leader. Seven days a week. Ten news. Oh, thank you. Hi, Gia. I love your outfit. It's so sweet. Welcome to the party. I've been meaning to give you a call. Uh, I'm sorry, I've just been so busy. I suppose that's not a good enough. That's piece. all right, Mrs. Spencer. You gave me a fair chance, and I appreciate that. Thank you. I'm glad that you came tonight. I guess it was Carly who invited you? No, she is my date. Oh, well, good. I, I hope you have a good time tonight. Um, you know what? I think it's time for me to start circulating again, so um, enjoy your night and uh, have something to eat. I think we have enough food to feed an army. Thanks, you Mrs. Too. Spencer. Nicholas, <clears throat> yeah. Can I have a word with you? Yeah, sure. You be all right for a minute? Absolutely. Okay. Don't tell me. The face of deception is the lady in red, isn't it? Well, like you said, we won't tell you. Just nod, if I'm correct. You're rushing the evening's climax. Gia has every right to be here, okay? Since you invited her, I guess she does. Lucky, look, even if I did not invite her, she did a great job for deception. I'm just trying to figure out what the point is why you brought her here. Look at all these people with cameras ready to rush the face of deception as soon as they hear the announcement. You seem so calm, you know, I really admire that. I have to admit I'd be a nervous wreck knowing I was about to become the focus of so much attention. I'm a little nervous, but I can handle it. Did it occur to you how Gia could get hurt by all this? I mean, she has to listen to Mom make the announcement that Elizabeth is the winner. I, how is that a good thing? G Gia, she loves modeling, all right? She knows she did a terrific job, and besides, this party is a tons of people that can jumpstart a career, regardless of deception. Okay? And besides, you gotta 
I can't admit she looks uh, incredible in that dress. Yeah, she does. Well, listen, she's just doing the best she can tonight. She's enjoying herself, so just let her be. Okay? So I read in this magazine about the typical day in a supermodel's life, and I honestly cannot imagine how they do it. I mean, they can barely walk out their doors without being mobbed. Love letters pouring in from complete strangers, and, well, the media following them everywhere and publicizing every single personal detail they can get their hands on. And throughout it all, they have to remain poised and confident and looking great. And, you know, I have to tell you, I really admire you for taking that on, Elizabeth. Then we're even, because I admire you for your convincing performance, Gia. <laughs> All right, so who needs fancy clothing and canopies when we have dishes and pots and pans to wash, huh? I just wish I could take you out. And do what? Well, we could start with a gourmet dinner. Okay, well, we already had Tammy's famous chili. We could go dancing. Dancing? Where did you do that? In the barn. Plus, there's a jukebox here. How do you do that? Oh, do what? You put a positive spin on everything. Yeah, well, I've been to a lot of fancy parties, and that's not really what counts, is it? It's all about the company. And you're the best. Why should I hide my face? I didn't do anything wrong. Of course you didn't. I had all the best of intentions. I acted honorably. I was reasonable, responsible. You still are. She was the one who left me at the altar, who has panic attacks every time you mention long-term commitment, who believes her time is better spent with gangsters and juvenile delinquents than with me. And if she wants to destroy any chance of having any semblance of a normal life, well, then that's her problem. I wasted enough time and energy trying to convince her otherwise. It's over. The need to. Next subject. Okay, I'm sorry. Obviously, you aren't in the mood to go to a party. Oh, actually, on the contrary. You said you needed to go out and about again. Well, so do I. I'm on my own. And I'm glad of it. So, I think uh, sipping some champagne and having some fun is exactly what the doctor ordered. There's a quote about those who protest too much, Ned. Who's protesting? Let's go. All right. If Alexis is there, are you still going to be glad you went? Chloe, put this on. It's over. I'm not going to pine about something that could have been. All right? I've cleared my things from her apartment, and now I'm going to clear some things from my head. The head part takes a lot longer, believe me. Do either one of us have a choice? Grab my purse. <laughs> you know what? If coming to my launch party is not your idea of a good time, why don't you just stay home, pop some popcorn, curl up with a law book? You have no idea how appealing that really sounds. Carly, can you save it for another what? night? What? She doesn't want to go. Why are you going to force her? She's just going to cause trouble anyway. How? She's Eddie's angel, Sonny. You know, the press will eat that up. No, oh, actually, the press milked that dry months ago. You know what? If I open the paper tomorrow and I see a picture of Mr. Sonny Corinthos and his lawyer instead of Mr. Sonny Corinthos with Mrs. Sonny Corinthos? What? What are you going to do? Are you going to yell at me over my morning coffee? No. You what know you what, Alexis? I just keep a low profile or stay home, He's okay? He's the one who wants me to go. Just remember what I said and don't be a media hog. There you go. There you go. Well, that's going to be a huge sacrifice considering how much I love getting my picture taken. I mean it, Alexis. You have to be really careful. This is my launch party. Well, I, I understand. understand. But the pictures oh, about about the section about me right. and about mm -hmm. Laura and... There you go. Not to my company. It looks good, though. Thank All right. You. All right, let's go. Can you get my coat? <laughs> okay. After you? Oh, no, after you. No, after me. It's okay, I'll get the door. Hold the elevator. Sorry. It's the button. I mean, it, I thought you were in, really. I... Let's play Truth or Dare. Truth. When you get a yeast infection, 
You use one of those messy creams, don't you? True. There may be an easier way. It's a pill, Diflucan. True. A pill that's as effective as the leading seven-day creams without the mess. Ready for the dare? I dare you to call your doctor to find out more about Diflucan. Sure, it takes a little effort, but tell the truth. A pill that treats yeast infections is worth it, isn't it? Oral Diflucan, the number one doctor-prescribed treatment for yeast infections. Kiss those creams goodbye. With Diflucan, there's an increased possibility of side effects compared with creams, including headache, nausea, and abdominal pain. In rare instances, serious effects on the liver and serious allergic reactions were reported. Do not use Diflucan if you are nursing. If you are pregnant or taking other medications, talk to your doctor. To prevent heart-related complications, do not take Diflucan if you are taking Propulsid. For more information, ask your doctor or call us. Oral Diflucan. You could choose to fight the appearance of lines and wrinkles. Or you can fight pores, blotches, tone, texture, dryness, and lines and wrinkles. In a study of these effective anti-aging creams, Total Effects was rated higher overall. Difficult choice. Total Effects from Olay. You're hot. Excuse me? How about a V8 splash to cool you down? No thanks. I know what you're thinking. Oh, V8, it must be rich and tomatoey. But in fact, V8 splash is refreshing and fruity. Mmm. It is fruity. Now, how about your phone number? No. Come on, I'm surprisingly refreshing, too. Fruity V8 Splash, a very different V8. And now introducing Diet V8 Splash, a diet drink that's actually good for you. What will he discover today? Well, with the new Play School Step Start Walk and Ride, Baby Power turns unsteady steps into great adventures. It's two toys in one. Play School, come and discover. Hmm. Oh, Vanda Camp's fillets. That's it. Hey, that's new. Marinated shrimp. Oh. Tenders. I love tenders. The irresistible taste of Vanda Camp's seafood makes it easy to love again and again and again. Vanda Camp's, the fish and shrimp you can't resist. Tonight, they took the challenge around the world in 60 days. I came out here to race and win this event. What drives people to seek adventure? Watch World News tonight. When you're a father, sometimes kids have to be punished. I want you to cut the grass with scissors, one blade at a time. And any lesson worth learning. Wow, Claire, that's a great job. Look, you missed a spot, though. <laughs> is worth learning twice. My Wife and Kids premieres Wednesday, March 28th on ABC. Did you ever see that movie, uh, that sci-fi movie where everything's the opposite of Earth? No, I think I missed that. That's what I feel like. I mean, here I am, the felon, and you're the golden girl. But here I am, living in some penthouse, and you're stuck here in some diner. I've got three people who completely and totally believe in me, but your family and friends treat you like a criminal. I don't think it's quite that bad. No. If Lucky... Lucky had not been invited to some party and Elizabeth stayed home in protest, you'd boycott it too, wouldn't you? Uh, yeah, but Elizabeth is the guest of honor. No, no, they could have done something. Told you how much they wanted you there. Asked Lucky's mom if you could bring a guest. And you would have gone. Well, probably not. That's but... why I didn't push it, Xander. That's not what is important to me. Being here with you is. Yeah, but still, it's... Yeah, Xander, look, they're all my good friends, okay? But we don't have to explain everything to everyone. You and I know how strong the bond is between us, so would you just cut them a little slack? I'll try. Okay, so you think you can keep an open mind without assuming the worst? How about a uh, slightly ajar mind? Hmm. Hey, okay, okay, it's open! <laughs> All right, okay, 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 okay. okay. If I didn't know better, I'd actually think you were being supportive. I honestly hope this works out for you. You do? Why? You know, forget trying to be nice. Enjoy yourself, honey. Thank you. I will. Elizabeth, 
Hi, darling. Hi, Graham. Oh, honey, I'm so sorry I'm late, but we were shorthanded at work, so I had to do a double shift, but I had to come by and give you a hug. Well, thank you. I just wish I could stay for the announcement so I could cheer the loudest. I am so proud of you. Well, I haven't done anything yet. So. Oh, now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I disagree. It wasn't that long ago when you hid your beauty and you shied away from all kinds of public exposure. In fact, you could hardly leave the house, remember? Oh, darling, you have overcome so much. I really am proud of you, as I'm sure you must be very proud of yourself. Come on. <laughs> Why aren't you over there with Laura? Amy, for crying out loud, this is her corporate debut, not her senior prom. And your point would be? My point is that she's over there working the scribblers, all right? And uh, I don't like scribblers. This is a cramper style. Yeah, and then while you stand back, somebody else goes and moves in. I'm just going to have to take my chances. Oh, dummy. Amy, hi. What hey. are you getting so worked up about? Uh, nothing. I was just telling Scotty how much you would love his support. Well, she has my support. She knows that. Elizabeth. Oh, hello. You look lovely. Oh, thank you. Have you seen Emily? Xander was invited, so she decided to stay at Kelly's to keep him company. What, and not be here to support you? I told her it was okay. I mean, Laura's gonna be here with me, and Lucky, of course, so... And Laura is a woman of excellent judgment, and I intend to thank her for not inviting that convict. I don't see Carly or Sonny. No, and I hope that means the entire criminal element has been excluded. Why, Mr. Schaefer, what a pleasure. I'm Elton Herbert. I'm so glad you could come. And I promise you, you shall have the best vantage point for photographing the face. The what? By the face of deception, of course. Now, I don't care about any face. I was told that Sonny Corinthos would be here making his first public appearance since the Christmas shooting. But if he's not coming, I got other places to be. Oh, well, well, certainly Mr. Corinthos will be here, but the face of deception is the news item of the year. Sonny Corinthos, have you fully recovered from the fire? Over here, Sonny. Uh, Mr. Corinthos, are you afraid for your life? Are you taking any steps to protect yourself? Is your wife bringing the bodyguard to work? Are you rebuilding your warehouse? Can we expect more shootings in Port Charles? How are you feeling? To me, comfort food is Olive Garden's hot, homemade pasta fagioli soup. They make it with fresh everything. And you can get all you want with their unlimited soup, salad, and breadstick lunch. I feel warm all over just talking about it. Olive Garden, when you're here, you're family. Come on. Grammy nominees 2001 R&B Rap is the year's best hip-hop collection. Let me see that The exclusive collection from the most respected award show in music. Get your copy of the year's ultimate hip hop CD. Grammy nominees 2001 R&B Rap. 17 Grammy nominees on one CD, including Nelly, Cisco, Aaliyah, Dr. Dre, Common, and Mystical. Shake it fast. Show me what you're working with. Shake it fast. Watch yourself. The year's best R&B and rap is now available on one CD. Grammy nominees 2001 also features hits from Tony Braxton, DMX, Beastie Boys, Eminem, D'Angelo, and R. Kelly. Grammy nominees 2001 R&B rap also features Jill Scott. Erica Badu, Brian feeling. McKnight, Kelly Price, and Joe. Oh, I wanna know. Now, get your copy of the year's ultimate hip hop collection, Grammy nominees 2001 RB Rap. Call in order now to receive a free limited edition poster. Grammy nominees 2001 R&B Rap. Call the number on your screen or send 1898 CD, 1598 cassette, plus 4 shipping and handling to the address below and purchase Grammy nominees pop for an additional 1898 CD, 1598 cassette. Rush delivery available. Order now. The Chic Extreme 3. Triple blade performance. Pivoting head. And after a bunch of great shaves, we just serve up another Chic Extreme 3. Chic, shave something. <laughs> oh, the tragedy of using a dandruff shampoo. 
Note how isolated it makes people feel. Its unpleasant smell. The absence of rich lather. Note its name, Nizorol AD, the world's most prescribed ingredient for dandruff in non-prescription strength. People can stay dandruff-free by doing this with Nizorol AD just twice a week. Just twice a week. What a pity. Nizorol AD, the freedom will go to your head. Try our new non-medicated daily conditioner for even silkier, shinier hair. You never know what they're going to ask on The View. I read that you said way back when you used to be quite the womanizer and you would do four, maybe five broads in an afternoon. What? Now, is this true? It's uh, true. I did it yesterday. <laughs> what will they ask Liam Neeson Monday on The View? <laughs> That's good. I wish I could stay, but I've got a 10 o'clock curfew. See you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. You know what, Xander? You <clears throat> probably shouldn't go through the alley. Oh. Aren't you supposed to call a car or something? It's three blocks. Yeah, I know, but what Sunny said that... I feel like a pampered snob if I call a chauffeur. <sighs> it's two minutes, okay? No one will see me. Mm-hmm. Mr. Corinthos, do you believe the PCPD is corrupt? Will Joseph Sorrell go to prison? Sonny, how's your health? You know what? Um, my lawyer will answer all the questions. It's my wife's night. We're here to launch her new company, Deception. If you would care to talk about Deception, why don't you step up with me and call that? It's unbelievable. What? Well, you're the main event, and Sonny and Carla seem to be grabbing the spotlight. Oh, I'm just on nobody until the ad campaigns come out. You're too modest. Guess I'm gonna have to keep telling you till you believe it. Nice party. It would be nicer if my daughter were here, but she's decided to be loyal to Xander. You know, Emily looks up to you. She's even decided to be a lawyer, just like you. If you had any sense of responsibility, you would encourage her to stay away from him. Uh, Xander's just trying to right his wrong. Oh. He, he really deserves a chance to do that, at least I think, and, and Emily seems to think that too, and this really is not the best place in the world to be arguing. Well, there's Alexis doing what she does best. Defending the indefensible. You know, you are missing the point completely. That deviant would be in prison for the rest of his life if it weren't for his crime lord protector, Sonny Corinthos. You know something? I, for one, am not happy to stay at a party where gangsters are welcomed with open arms. I agree. Let's leave. Fine. Show me the way. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Carly, can I talk to you for a moment? Uh, hi. Hi. Here. Huh? Can you find a way to get the press away from Sonny? Oh, well, this is your party. You deal with it. I could use a little help. But that's a switch, Laura. You picked the food. You invited the guests. You've picked to face a deception all by yourself without any input from me. Now, you want my help because Sonny's here? Forget it. I'll do it myself. Wait, okay. You have a point. The reporters are here for deception, not for Sunday. So I'll see what I can do. I was just thinking that now would be a good time to get their attention and make the announcement about the new face. Why now? We did the party just started. I don't know. <laughs> There's no time like the present. No, no, no. I, th I was thinking that maybe we should, we should put it off just for a little while. You know, keep them in suspense. Our guests will be more intrigued if we keep them guessing. <laughs> hmm. Well, that is a good point. Okay, well, maybe I'll just get their attention and make an announcement that there's going to be an announcement. That's a good thing. Okay, yeah, I'll get it prepped. Good. Okay, great, thanks. Gia. Right. Yeah. Uh, people, people. Thank you, Elton. First of all, I'd like to welcome you all to the deception offices. As you know, 
Our new product line you still will be want to be the face the of deception? Later this well, year yes, but don't you think it's a little late? No, it's not too late. You just have to work for is it. Is our new face of deception? Well, what can and I do? We will be you can make sure that Laura goes up to the roof minutes. and gets stuck there. <laughs> so, the best hour. is yet to come. Please enjoy mm -hmm. yourselves. And uh, thank you so much for being here with us to celebrate Deception's big night. Stay tuned for scenes from the next General Hospital. The critics can't resist. The Los Angeles Times calls Chocolat delectable. It's a joyous film. Audiences can't resist. I loved it. Sensual. Extremely sexy. I thought it was one of the best movies of the year, and I've seen everything. Treat yourself to the season's most delicious surprise. It cracked me up the whole way through. It's an aphrodisiac. Now nominated for five Academy Awards, including Best Picture of the Year. I'm taking my boyfriend, yeah. for sure. Chocolat. My favorite. I knew that. Rated PG-13. Now playing. How many one-liter bottles would you have to buy to equal the amount of water you get from one pure faucet mount? About 378. Pure faucet mount filters. Pure water made easy. It's here, McDonald's next big thing, the new Big and Tasty. Now just 99 cents to celebrate the opening of Disney's California Adventure, Disney's newest theme park, right next door to Disneyland in California. So, how does a 99 cent Big and Tasty sound? Oh, I don't believe this. What? Well, look what she's using to clean that window. Windex. Ain't that what they're supposed to use? Well, yeah, if you want a clean window. Ah, look at him, huh? He's got that other stuff nice and streaky. Oh, come on. Windex even cleans what the other stuff leaves behind. So? So, a bird could get hurt flying into a window like that? The difference is clear. For a streak-free shine every time, Windex is best on glass. What's this? New mountain berry scent. Fresh. You can try anything to get some relief from your nasal allergy symptoms. But before you change your life, make an easier change. Ask your doctor about Flonase. Multi-symptom Flonase relieves all these nasal allergy symptoms. Sneezing, itchy, runny nose, and congestion. Multi-symptom Flonase once a day relieves them all, all day and night. For best results, use daily. Side effects are generally mild and may include headache, nosebleed, or sore throat. Call to learn more. So before you change your life, make an easier change. Ask your doctor about multi-symptom Flonase. When you get it all, all it takes is Flonase. Come on. No, Scott. I don't think we should. Come on. It'll feel good. You promise? We're old enough. Well... Okay. On the next General Hospital. Get him out of here. Let's go. You have a half hour to get Laura up onto the roof before she announces the new face. Word is, you're the new face of deception. Why do I think you're up to something? Why are you so suspicious? Get the latest news about your favorite soaps and read the inside scoop only at abc.com. Get swept away all this month on Port Charles. Have you ever felt as if you'd loved someone even before you met? What if you could go back in time and find out? It's a whole new kind of storytelling starting Monday. Poor Charles, time in a bottle. Soaps will never be the same.